Alright. Whoa. <laughs> that was a sudden music change. Um, we're back with more Mega Man Maker, and we're playing through Avalanche Man by Fellyboom04. Um, yeah. And this stage is, from my understanding, part of a level pack here. Well, yeah. It's quite blatantly <laughs> part of a level pack because we have all these power ups, and yeah, you're supposed to. Well, all the items that you find in stages, you can keep from stage to stage, and you just gotta trust the player to pick up, you know, what they have acquired, so yeah. I am not entitled to any of those <laughs> items in there, so we're just gonna run on out and see what this is all about, and yeah, this will be a winter-themed level. It's looking pretty nice so far. Let's see. I'm a little bit rusty now, I haven't played in a <laughs> while, so yeah, I'm a, I'm a little bit... Shake here, as you can see. Yeah, I'm taking city damage here. Ooh. Whoa! Oh! God. <laughs> okay, calm down. Let's just take it easy. I really do like these ice blocks here. They're a lot of fun to platform with, if you will. Nice. Nice checkpoint placement, and I, yeah, I think we're gonna play around a little bit more with the freeze cracker here. Yeah, I just recently learned that you can actually angle this one. I can't believe how I never noticed that while well, playing for well, however long it's been out. Oh yeah, that's right. The freeze cracker doesn't really freeze for very long. Yeah, it's for a very brief amount of time. <laughs> Gotta be a little bit careful with that and. Thank you, Coil. Are we actually gonna use it again? <laughs> whoa! Whoa! Oh! <laughs> Dude, that... Yeah. That, those off screen ice blocks really messed with me there. <laughs> that was kind of funny how he just came back there. I expected him to go off screen. And the level does not seem too hard. Ooh, I want that. Wow! <laughs> I thought I could make that. I should have just brought out the rush coil. But yeah, the level doesn't seem too hard, so we might. Whoops! We might do both Avalanche Man and. There was another stage. Let me just check real fast here. Avalanche Man and Thermo Man. We might just do both in the same video here. Depending on how long each stage here takes me. Like, if it's just 10 or 15 minutes, then we might as well just. Do a two for one here. And we're back. I'm gonna mess with that up this time. Huh. Well, just gonna do this. Don't really need the health. Ooh. Some interesting layout here. And very nice. Even some energy refills. Hmm. Yeah, <laughs> I kind of figured this would come again. Uh, okay, so. You want to be really tricky, we could jump up here and lay down a rush, <laughs> rush coil, but that's kind of cheating. And here we could just shoot this to make this easier. Very nice, okay. I gotta pat myself on the back there. That was a nice strategy. And yeah, don't kill this guy. That would be kind of stupid, honestly. <laughs> well, you know what? Thank you. Well, you know what? We're actually gonna, yeah, take this guy out. That would have been a nasty jump otherwise. Bonk your head on this icicle there. Mm -hmm. 
Well, so we definitely do have some recurring thieves here, yeah. These hanging platforms. And I assume this is the final boss. Was it too hard? You know, typically level packs aren't all that difficult. Um, which is appropriate, you know. It would be kind of weird if you just went bonkers from the start all the way to the end, then there wouldn't be much of a... Well, it wouldn't really feel like a game, I guess. Well, I mean... I think you know what I'm saying. <laughs> it wouldn't feel like a traditional Mega Man game. That is... Oh, wow, dude, that was a nice... Nice dodge there. <sighs> Shot too early. And... Thank you. Yeah, I almost, almost, I always kind of forget that you have to treat Freeze Man as Crash Man, you know. Just shoot and let him jump over you. Let's see what we're up in time here. That did not take very long at all. Yeah, seven minutes. Yeah, no, no, no. We're definitely doing another one. <laughs> okay, well, it was a fun level. Let's see here. Thermo Man. Yeah, okay, see, there are only these two uploaded here this far, so yeah. Okay, well, we did the Avalanche Man and we got the, uh, well, the three-way fire weapon. I forget what it's called, so I will allow myself to pick that one up. Or, no, no, I'm... Wait, what? How does it work? We clearly got the fire after defeating him. And we somehow started with the ice in the level. Yeah, you know, uh, I'm just going to pick up both fire and ice here. <laughs> How about that? Whoops, get that out of here. And I don't think I had any E-Tanks when I finished the level, so... Yeah. Well... Oh, wait, where's my fire? <laughs> my fire is gone! No! <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, we're just gonna have to make do with the Ice Cracker then. So, maybe we'll see some of these... Well, we'll probably see lava dispensers and perhaps even some of those Mega Man 1 fire type dispensers, whatever they are called, in this level here. Well, actually, we're on, on rooftops. Well, this would. Yeah, it would seem like. I like this kind of visual. Effect to you, if you will. I definitely play a few level where you go from rooftop to rooftop, but yeah, we don't see them too often. And yes, very, yeah, very much as I said so before. Um, we do indeed have the Mega Man One fire thingies. Yeah, we're gonna be a little bit careful with these guys to <laughs> deal 4 damage each time they hit us. Uh... The... What? Let's just bypass that. <laughs> Whoops, you cannot freeze that? Well, it would've been kinda cool if you could've. I think there's a way to destroy them, but only a few weapons actually can. And yeah, that's how you deal with these guys. Just freeze them and... Okay, well, we're supposed to go down. Um, yeah, just freeze them and shoot them. Walk up to them and... Put your arm cannon through them. Oh my god! Get out of it! Oh, it goes up and down. Okay. You know, I haven't seen a level do this yet. Why have I not seen anyone do this before? This is actually, like, Super Mario-like when the water goes up and down. Except here you die. <laughs> if you touch the water. <clears throat> well, yeah, this is a cool effect. Ooh. And that is a nice way of giving the player a knee tank. Actually, here's what we're gonna do. Nice. I wonder if that's even possible without the freeze. It might be. But it's gonna be really tight. You would like have to slide as fast as possible and then just make a jump for it. Oh no, okay. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah, I, I do realize, of course, I could have used the ice 
uh, cracker there too, but yeah. I don't want to ship everything out. <laughs> Actually, I wonder, can we... Okay, uh, I just had to test that. I did not know if you could... Well, defuse the flame there with the ice weapons. I'm pretty sure the water ones can do so, but yeah. Wow. Oh my, look at the health. I lost so much health, I was too cocky. And there is some construction work going on. Close to where I live, like on the floor above, so yeah, hopefully the mic doesn't pick it up. Not too much, at the very least, I hope. Okay, more of this. Oh, <laughs> it's still scary, I thought it was coming for me there. Yeah, you know, I like the ice stage, but this I like even better. Yeah. I, yeah, this is a fun gimmick to interact with your and See, look at this. If you get hit, if you get hit here, you'll get stunned and you'll get engulfed. So, yeah. Gotta time it just right. That was not right. Well, let's just do that. And I actually kind of need that. <laughs> Don't mess this one up. Yeah, in theory it's not that bad of a jump, but you know, on, when it's on the last screen you get a little bit... Just a tad bit nervous. And Pharaoh for the boss, okay. Let's see if we can't destroy him Buster only. Nice. Ooh, jump. 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 Okay, well, we're working on Flawless here. Dude! <laughs> Stop jumping. <laughs> it's making the Flawless run very difficult. Very nice. Okay, so he also dropped it. Okay, so maybe these two levels were just um, kind of um, showcases. Uh, you know, since we get the same weapons from both guys here. Maybe. Well, that was very fun to play. Um, once again, I like the Thermo Man stage a little bit more than Avalanche Man, which, of course, too, was a very nice stage. But yeah, I think I mainly like this one better because it's because, you know, I haven't seen the firewall bob up and down like that before. I, I really enjoy that one. That has a lot of potential to, you know, build upon. You can do so many things with that and like more, you know, having more gimmick items, you know. Yeah, there is so much potential for that. I, I can't believe that I have not seen that before. Uh, nonetheless, that's a very cool ID by Fellyboom04 out there. I hope more people um, start doing this too, because, yeah, it's a, it, it was definitely a very fun gimmick to interact with, so yeah, there. Um, but yeah, once again, that was a fun level pack to play. Um, we might actually try a, f a few more of these stages, like, they weren't very long and very hard anyway, so, you know, you know, uh, uh, yeah, <laughs> it shouldn't take me too long to finish the whole pack if I do decide to play the whole thing. So yeah, like if you if you feel like you can, at the very least, give me two more stages if you would like me uh, to see me play them. Yeah, <laughs> I would definitely not mind at all. So yeah, we're just gonna leave it off with that. Thank you guys so very much for playing and have a nice day.